Hello once again everyone and welcome back to you Tales from the Borderlands uh, Episode 2 came out yesterday so we're going to start it finally after like four months of waiting for it Damn you Telltale Waiting, making us wait so long for a, for a new episode Good old western style music! <laughs> so I'm doing pretty good right now. Ish, relatively speaking. Wee bit tired because I've been doing night shifts. Uh, this week. everyone knows. where was I? Ah, yes. Two unlikely versions of running, running possible story. The Hyperion salary man who stumbled across the perfect plan to defeat his rival. The bad things can happen when you swim against fate. Hijacking the secret purchase of the ultimate prize, a vault key. Finding co-conspirators was easy. Finding real vault keys never easy. Then there's the Pandoran Hustler who conspired to sell a fake vault key. But unfortunately, plans don't often go, you know, as planned. A bullet saved is a bullet earned. And now they were stuck with each other, with nothing to gamble but their lives. So. They prepared to face psychos, warlords, even vault hunters. But betrayal. No one is prepared for betrayal. She knew what would happen. She got it. And she let me. The money was gone. But the path to a vault key was right under their feet. Below the arena, they found the Gortis project, Atlas's crown jewel, along with a lost king, looking to regain his throne. <laughs> oh, the, the art style, man. I'm, I'm up. Hey, I'm up. seriously, can you use your words? <sighs> You're just wasting bullets with that thing. Mm, yeah, okay. Ah, oh, come on, you drooled on me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, that's a. Wow, that's a lot. I am feeling a little dehydrated. <laughs> what is wrong with you? There, now we're even. You are a monster. Stop. I'm gonna let you out of those restraints. Don't make me regret it, because you'll regret it much more. Mm -hmm. Sure, yeah, okay. Yeah, we, that works for me. Let's do that. Um, We've got a long way to go. We should move before the sun's up. Can I please hit him once? Just to get it out of my system. You gotta work on your anger management. All this animosity is not good for- Just one. What? <laughs> okay, I'm good. Uh, you punched me in the neck. Let's go. I'm on so incredible. Well, <laughs> what is it? Buddy, you uh, you all right? Does this mean you're 
happy? I think that's it. He's all right. He, you know, just probably needs some air. So, uh, upstairs, where there's more air, because it's higher, and... Hey, what's up with that map? Yes, what is up with that map? Computer enhance. I don't think it can hear you. Oh, that's what it wants us to think. You hear me, machine? I'm on to you. Enhance. Enhance computer images. Stop it! This is not how computers work. Where are you from? You, you don't just yell enhance at the screen. Maybe I can bring up a legend on this thing. Ah! I'm okay. Did you break it? Go ahead, Fiona. Uh, pick it up. Hey, Fee, trust me. You don't want to touch that. I don't understand. You and Reese are the only ones that didn't shock. Maybe they're somehow imprinted on you. Vintage Atlas. Uh, incredible. Definitely incredible. Retinal scanner online. Security protocol engaged. Retinal scan required. Please step forward and identify yourself. Uh, maybe we should get out while we have a chance. That map could lead us to a vault. We're not leaving until we know exactly where it's telling us to go. Yes, we have to figure it out so we can get there. The money. What's taking so long? There's someone in there. What do you mean, someone? Who is it? Are they alive? No idea who it is, but they are very much not alive. Guess I should have known it'd go like this. Yep. Probably. Oh, craps. That's probably not. Wait, you hear that? Sounds like this General Pollux never made it out of the room. Well, that's creepy. Definitely. I'm guessing it's. The strange cabinet that we previously looked at. Whoa, whoa, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's exactly what I thought I was going to see. Well, now all we have to do is get his eye to that retinal scanner. Oh, maybe we can just. Scoot him over to the computer. Oh, so many button presses. Oh, his legs are stuck. Well, that's not gonna work. He's wedged in there pretty tight. Should we just? Well. It's a retina scanner, right? We don't actually need all of him for that. Ripping out of eyes, eh? Ooh, how much you got? Not that much. Now you'd think a general would have more walking around money on him. 
like I had dropped. Look at his uniform. Atlas military, high ranking at that. If you try to rip it out with your bare hand, you'll just end up squishing it. Uh, if you have a better idea. Any other idea would be a better idea! His eyes are pretty creepy. Oh, I know. He's basically doing him a favor. I'm not sure he would agree. I know exactly what to do here. We get the spark. It's a tool. Hey, it's a spoon and a fork. Ha! How about that? Oh, wait, that's not. Yep. The eyes gotta come out one way or another. <laughs> Let's do this. Okay, this is going to be okay. disgusting. Yeah, yeah, you, you gotta do it. I, I gotta do it. I gotta do it. So I just, just shove that into his face. Why do you have to say it like that? I'm just saying. Did you just do it already. Okay. Mm. <laughs> Why did that? Split the eye right in half. All the juice from the thing. Is... Why are you describing it to me? I know. I did it. Right. Sorry. Look, all I'm saying is, you got one more shot. Right, because he's got two eyes. One eye. Now. You've got a knack for numbers, don't you? I'll just wait over there. Here we go. Right, so far so good. Stop talking to me. <laughs> That's a really cool uh, angle for the camera. Ooh, I can't tell if that's looking better or looking worse. It's looking way worse. Trust me. If you're gonna puke, do it on the floor, please. <laughs> this is me helping. Yeah, you're helping a lot. Ooh, oh, you almost, you almost got it. Just cut the thing, holding it to the the thing. I don't got it. Fun! It's getting all dusty. It's just a peeled grape. It's just a peeled grape. Let's just get this thing over to the scanner. Man, that was really, really cool. It's for the female! Hello, Pollux. Too bad I missed you in Old Haven. As you've no doubt surmised, the Gordis project has been terminated. And now that you have no soldiers under your command, I regret to inform you that you've been relieved of your duties. I'll come by soon to ease your transition into retirement. What's Old Haven? It's an Atlas mining town. It's been abandoned for years. Which makes it the perfect place to hide a Gordis project. Whatever that is. Message to General Pollux. Memorandum. If you're watching this, then I'm already in suspended animation. You must understand. Adina was trying to kill me. And what I possess is far too powerful to end up in the arsenal of a ruthless mercenary. Athena is no longer a threat. Please activate the revival protocol in my stasis dock. My life and quite possibly the fate of the universe is in your hands. Yep, that's there. Oh no. Does that mean he was oh when you scooped oh No way. No. No, he had to be dead when we <sighs> don't. Just don't. There is anesthesia, not dead. So 
Ne. Yes. What's wrong with a man? Quite literally. Wait, what? I didn't hit my head. What are you talking about? I saw you hit that girder. No, 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 no. I, I, I hit my head on that, but I didn't hit my head when I fell into the computers. And obviously there wasn't a geyser of blood. There was quite a bit of blood. This is all fascinating, very thorough. But what about Jack? Oh, right. His eyes changed. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the Gordis Project. And it's gonna lead us to a vault. And then I'll probably kill you. <laughs> what? Okay. Here's what's gonna happen. You, uh... I'm sorry. What's your name again? Come on. Spit it out, dum dum. I don't have all day. I. Oh, oh good. <laughs> you work for me. I thought, I thought I was gonna have to get violent there for a second, or more violent. Truck. You're no best friend me. <laughs> Come on, time's a waste. Turrets, no automated <laughs> It's like. Atlas is just begging us to take it. Come on, Cupcake, what's the holdup? Get out of here! Yeah, I know, I'm your hero, you're my biggest fan, blah, 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 welcome to the club. Just trying to wipe yourself again. You might show yourself how to All right, take notes, kiddo, I'm not one to repeat myself. Jack, what? <laughs> this is impossible. Jack, you're... you're dead. Uh, I'm dead? I'm sorry, what's that supposed to mean? Are you threatening me, little man? Well, no, 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 no. Why did that just happen? Um, oh, shut up. Are you screaming because you're in pain, or are you just freaking out because this is really weird? Because it is, it is weird. <laughs> nice try, but it's not, it's not happening. This is this doesn't make any sense. Oh, it makes complete sense. Still, damn it. Stop doing that! It's like I told you, Handsome Jack is dead. No, 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 no. That's impossible. I, I can't die. It's, it's, no, 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 it's, it's stupid. No way. <sighs> Never had to tell someone they died before, so uh, sorry. That must suck. Uh, heroes don't die, <laughs> especially not before the story gets to the good part. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm, I'm, I'm handsome, Jack. <laughs> I don't die. Hey, there's too much left to do. I'm not, not happening. Not happening. Hey, give me a cupcake. Just let me try to rip your throat out one more time. Just one more time. Come here. What? No, no. Uh, you see, I think I just gotta be quicker about it. That's what it is. Hey, hey. Come on, stop it. You're just wasting your time. Oh, I'll be the judge of that. <laughs> You're so stupid. Watch your head do it. What's the matter with you? Oh! Reese! So much pain? Why am I still conscious? I don't understand. Reese, hey, you all right? What the hell are you doing? I, I know that sounds weird, but I just, I just saw Handsome Jack. What are you saying? Handsome Jack, he was, he was next to me. Right. Okay. Well, you had quite a spill there. Let's just get you up off this thing. Here you go. You know, these fumes can't possibly be helping. Oh, I must be pretty out of it. I'm seeing stars. Shooting stars. 
Roll. Moonshots. Moonshots. Really? Moonshots? We need to get out of here. The loader bot. The loader bot. Hey. Oh, I can feel the system. Thanks. Get it! We gotta go! <laughs> Why is Hyperion trying to kill us? Don't you work for those guys? I'll file a complaint with HR when we get back. But we have to not die right now! We used up our boost getting out of there! How long till it recharges? A few minutes, at least. Give me the wheel. What? Why? Uh, I'm not hearing a good reason. Trust me, I'm a good driver. <laughs> not better than me! No, 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 he's right! He's got Echo Eye! He can actually see where the moonshots are gonna land! Wanna live? Give me the wheel. Then what? We'll go to Hollow Point. They can't track us there. Let me do it! I can do it! You know what you're doing. Trust me. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Just keep us alive until that thing is full and then we can boost out of here. Got it? Yeah, I got it. I got it. I don't got it! So basically, f um, the Tantrum Jack we're seeing right now is the virtual uh, intelligence, the AI that um, Nakamura created um, in uh, Borderlands, the brief sequel. And we see, you see that in the brief sequel. Oh no, load a butt! Clearing the racks. Incoming! Oh dear. My arm. I'm bleeding. Shut up, Vaughn. Rakai! Rakai! It's a skin condition! It's a Rakai! <laughs> it's not awesome! No, 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 no! No, that's bad. That's bad, that's bad, that's very bad! We're gonna die! Help, Reese! I'll cover the back! Get off me, Rack! That's not good. Not good at all. Oh uh, shit. Uh, I haven't even started my timer. Oh, my I can't take this thing anymore. We can't stop it. Not with these guns. Come on! Whoa! 
Okay, that's the other tile. Normal motion. <sighs> Till death do us part. Just one sure. That's not good. The list of things that might kill us keeps getting longer. I hadn't even thought about moonshots. Brax, skags, bandits, dehydration, heat stroke, regular stroke, stroke, stroke. Whatever that is. That murder pile. The list just keeps getting longer. I've never felt so alive! <laughs> this is awesome! I can't imagine going back to financial reports. Ugh, boring! Um, That's the spirit, buddy. It's just... This a I know it's weird to say, but I'm having a great time. That's good, man. I feel the same way. This! This is what I'm talking about! Mixing it up with Hyperion, teaming up with grifters? Come on! These are the types of stories we'll tell our children when we're millionaires! We just survived moonshots from Hyperion! Huh? Friggin' moonshots, man! It's true. I am not afraid anymore! You hear me, Hyperion? I am Vaughn, and I am not afraid! Yo, what the hell was that? Relax. It's a vet. Oh. Okay. I have to pee. Nope. Not because I was scared. I, I had to go anyway. This sure. is perfect timing. Reese, you're alive. Yeah. Thank God you guys are okay. I thought that was it for a second there. I am so relieved. Now there doesn't seem to be any permanent damage, but I can't really account for internal bleeding. Tell her to send some supplies! Yeah, don't talk to me while you're peeing. Thank you. Sorry! Almost done! Run. Anyway, I got them to stop shooting, but I can't keep Vasquez from wanting to take you guys out. I'm doing what I can, but it's chaos up here. So I can't talk long. Vaughn is requesting supplies. Oh, and we're stranded out here in the desert. Look, I'm able to track you, so stay safe for now. I'll send what I can. Cool. Hopefully she can help us out. We can't be walking through the desert too Damn, you ripped, man. To go through all this and die of dehydration would be 
Pretty lame. Uh, Vaughn? Should I be calling a doctor? What? Why? What's happening? Because you are all cut up. <laughs> what? what? Am I bleeding? Where? No, I'm what? Safe. You're weirdly buff. <laughs> I put an exercise bike in my office a few months ago. Don't worry about it. Right. He is pretty young. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta say, I'm a little envious of the definition he's got going. Could you stop sneaking up on me? Who's sneaking? I don't sneak. Oh, so you've been here this whole time? Yeah. Oh. Reese, who are you talking to? So he definitely can't see me, right? Hey, so remember earlier when uh, I said I could see Handsome Jack? Sure, right after you fell off the ledge. <laughs> oh, yeah, right. Well, it's true. Uh, he's standing right next to you. Right. Right. So, Handsome... <laughs> handsome Jack is standing next to me. Yes. And I can't see him, but you're able to see him and also talk to him. Correct. That does sound pretty crazy. He definitely thinks you're crazy. Who exactly is this little muscle-bound tool? <laughs> I'm not crazy. <laughs> Yet. Okay. Ask him how many fingers I'm holding up. Uh, I don't know. He's scratching his ass and, uh... Oh! God, I think he may have pissed on his shirt. That's not yeah, clean. How many? Three. Three. You're holding up three fingers. Lucky guess. You know it's not. Come on. We should get out of the sun. I... I don't understand. <laughs> Join, Join the, the club. club. Jinx. Let's go. I can't tell if I'm crazy or... You're crazy? I think we're all a little crazy right now. Yeah, I don't know what state of being uh, I'm in right now, but, uh, well, walking still sucks. Man, what are the odds? What does he mean? Yeah, what do you mean? Well, I mean, of all the people in the universe, Handsome Jack could be appearing to, it just happens to be the guy who's totally obsessed with him. <laughs> I mean, it's crazy! like destiny. Uh, what? Should I be creeped out right now? Because I'm feeling a little creeped out. This is just a coincidence, Vaughn. Men make their own destiny. You sound like Vasquez. You sound, uh, like you're dodging the question. Uh, you obsessed with me, Cupcake? I mean, think about it. You got all the Jack posters in your office, dude. I think that's a little weird. That makes two of us. Yeah, those are Motivational posters. You like the cat? Hang it. I have a reference to three sheikle. What do with the Nakayama drive? Namiyaka. What? Why does that sound familiar? No, I did shove a bunch of data, you know, straight into my head. Ah, Nakayama. Right. The weirdo that was obsessed with me. Other weirdo. Weirdo that was obsessed with me. Oh man, Hyperion would kill to get their hands on this. This? You. Your head or body or whatever Jack is in. Yeah, they would, wouldn't they? Whatever version of Jack you've got in there, Nakayama stored it for a reason. You know, this could actually save our careers. Yes, yes, exactly. You need to get me back up there, kid. Get me into Hyperion, <laughs> and you won't yeah, regret it. I guess so. Yeah, we'll run that place together, kiddo. Huh? You, me. Mostly me, but whatever. But uh, that's that's what we gotta do. For a startler. It's about time. Thank you. Hopefully, she included some water. Uh oh, incoming! <laughs> it's coming right for us. Hey, I guess that tracker's working, huh, boys? It's coming right <laughs> for us! Go to Papa! <laughs> <coughs> 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 
Best Chris? Nice sock. Fancy meeting you two here. Here I was, out for a nice drive, and I land right on just the guys I was looking for. It's red, Hugo. I thought you wanted your car in black. Ho ho ho. <laughs> Let's see what you did there. That's funny. You steal my car, you make jokes about it. That's good, that's great stuff. Yeah, I think it's pretty good to hear you. Look, I know we had a deal. And uh, while I don't like to go back on an agreement... Oh, that's right, you... we did have a deal! You convinced me to double-cross my best friend, and the day isn't even over before you're double-crossing me?! Oh, <laughs> oh man, when you put it like that, it does sound awful. Wow, man. Just... wow. Should've known better than to trust a snake like you. Oh, don't be like that, little guy. It's just the way of the, uh... Listen, I'm gonna go see if I got a shirt in the trunk, because your body is making me uncomfortable. Hold tight, kids. Look! I told him I would sell you out, but I swear I wasn't gonna do it. I was just saying whatever he wanted to hear to keep the jerk off our backs. I wasn't gonna follow through with it. Please. It's cool. Is it? Sure. My friend. I can't tell if. What's that? Digging our own graves? Yeah, devils, genius. You two freaks start digging. I want to see a decent grave going before too long. You heard me. Don't make me tell you again. <laughs> You're gonna pay for this. You'll see. Yeah, because we have friends. Dangerous friends that will hunt you down to the ends of Pandora. Well, that... that, uh, that sounds exhausting. Well, I guess it's a good thing I'll be leaving this ball of hot garbage real soon. What part of Dig don't you understand? Let's get going, Mr. Universe. Okay, just don't shoot. Oops. There you go. A little hard work never killed anybody. I mean, you're gonna die. Yeah. Faster. Time is money, Reese. Really? You want me to dig my own grave faster? <laughs> oh. Reese! Oh. 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 Damn. Damn, that smarts. I think I did that wrong. I got a tough noggin. Looks so easy in the movies, but... Amateur hour. You gotta aim for the bridge of the nose, dumb dumb. How is it every time I show up, you idiots are in a worse situation? <laughs> You're not helping. Uh. All right, fun's over. Looks like we'll be settling for the shallow variety of graves. Reese, you die first, and then he can load your body in the car. I'll bury Vaughn myself. What? Yeah, they want this idiot's body for something up there. Something uh, important floating around in his head. This is a prototype. The most advanced gun Hyperion. Yes, not... Someone's overcompensating. <laughs> yep. There. Any Good. Last words before the, what is the inevitable to eat shit. Yeah, that's the spirit. <laughs> Well, that was three words. And I'll be sure to put eight shit on your tombstone. And I'd be more worried about my tombstone if you knew where the safety was. You're hilarious. I'm gonna miss your... <sighs> Gosh damn it. Uh, is there a problem? Yeah, I know how to shoot a gun. Looks like it. I just wanna get the maximum damage out of this thing. Okay, look. As much as I'd love to watch this idiot kill you two idiots, I can't let that happen. I'm... I'm... 
inside of I'm not inside you, but I'm like, look, if you go, I go. I've enhanced your echo eye, so use it to hack something and get us the hell out of this jam. Figure out how you can pay me back later. I've got you back. Right. I'll get mess this guy up. Hmm. Heavy, but it's solid. Right. This is a button. Button. <laughs> Push this in. Oh, <laughs> subsystem access. That's new. Something feels locked. Safety on this. The safety. Okay, we got power. Oh, What's wrong with this thing? Well, there we go. Wait. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing with your hands? Uh, uh, Hello. <laughs> this is an interesting little development. Fine, look, we gotta go. This is my head. Get out! Oh, come on, don't be like that. Stop using my own hand against me, bitch! Oh, you see, you see what you did? You hit your race. Let's get out of here. You're a freak! That's what? I don't know how long I'll be going for it, so I'm going to pause it here, because I think it's probably going to be a long episode, that one, and I'll see you guys next time for another episode. Peace out, Girl Scouts.